Hey guys, Anthony here with a video tonight on how to attach two Boulder 15 solar panels. As you see here, there's one, and there's the second one. Sorry for the glare. And we are going to attach those with our Boulder Quick Clips. I have four here. I only need two for this project. So what we're going to do is flip the panels over, and I'll show you how the clips are attached. Okay, first we will flip the panels over. One. And two. And looking at the panels, you'll see there is a slot here and here. In fact, there's one there's two of these on each side of the panel, including the tops and bottoms. One, two. So, that is where the clips are going to go. Okay guys, since there's not very many good videos on YouTube showing how this attaches, this is the clip. I'm going to give you a close-up. And you're going to lay that clip flat on the panel with this little cross part, just like that and this laying flat so that way you could push it through the slot I had some trouble in fact I thought I had the wrong clips this little piece that slides into the channel of the panel you'll see fits really snug see I thought I had the wrong size clips or they made different sizes but they don't they do fit you just have to force them a little bit which I'll show you when I put them on the panel All right, guys if you're watching me you'll see how tight this is this clip is to get in the slot. Like I said, I thought I had the wrong size, but you got to kind of put it on an angle. It's really a pain. At least it is, it is for me on these panels. These are the newer panels. Like I said, I just had it a second ago. There it is. Okay. I got one corner under the lip. You could see it. Now I'm going to push it through. Okay. There it goes. That's what you want. And that thing, that little block, is really tight to get under there. So now we're going to mesh it up with the... I'll show you on one. We'll mesh it up with this panel. And then we'll twist this key or this little green lever and then push it down. But I want to get the other one done. Hopefully you guys can see this. Let's get the top one done. I want to push the top one through the other side. Okay, that one went in easy. Okay, I guess it's just the way they're made. So what I'm doing now, I'm just measuring up both slots. I'll show you guys here. So you got the slot on this panel is going to mesh up with the the clip end and then the clip end on this panel that I put through is going to mesh up with the top slot. And then they'll be together. So right now they're together but they're not locked in place. And now what I'll do show you guys here you will turn the clip on its side and then that brings that little T that little cross the other way to hold it in place and then you'll clip it down like that same thing with the top one I'm going to turn it and clip it now the panels are one. So now instead of two Boulder 15s, I have a Boulder 30 in essence together, like I'll show you here. There's my two clips one, two. Now all I have to do is take the color coded cord from one panel. So you have the male end here, and I'll plug it into the female end 
of this panel. I'll show you guys here on. Now the panels are together, and then my cord from the second panel will go straight to my battery. And then I'll be able to charge my battery pack from the panels. Or if I had a, a we're going to show with our solar controller, this would go into the solar controller on one end and the other side of the solar controller into my battery, my 18 amp hour battery. And these panels will charge that battery. And that's what we're going to set up for tomorrow. Now, this is just how to get the panels together, this video. Hopefully it helps, guys. I didn't see many on YouTube showing this. So thanks for watching. Questions, comments. As always, Anthony, stay ready.